Hey guys, it's Remy from Kensley Fitness, and if you want to calculate your one rep max for the weighted dip or the weighted pull up, this is a perfect video for you. So as you may know, for uh, the bench press, the deadlift, and the squat, it's very easy to calculate your one rep max. Uh, all you need is the amount of repetitions you did um, and the amount of uh, weight that is lifted on the barbell. Um, however, for weighted calisthenics, it's a bit different. Since your body is also moving when performing the uh, weighted pull ups and the weighted dips, your body weight has to be accounted into the calculation of the total weight uh, when you want to calculate one rep max. So we have a calculator where you could easily input your uh, body weight in addition to the weight that you added onto yourself when performing the weighted pull up and the weighted dip to uh, calculate your one rep max. So let's start with an example. Let's say you want to do pounds because you're American and uh, you can perform 16 repetitions of a movement and your body weight's uh, 160 pounds and you can do it with uh, 60 pounds extra. And if you calculate one rep max, it says that your one rep max is 152 pounds. And uh, we can also calculate your three rep max, five rep max, and eight rep max. So yeah, this is a great way to be able to calculate one rep max and seeing your uh, progress without having to actually test your one rep max because it can be very demanding on your body, uh, your central nervous system, and uh, obviously uh, there's a higher risk of injuries when you're doing such heavy uh, intensity. So let's say hypothetically we can only perform uh, 10 repetitions with this weight instead of 16. If we calculate one rep max, we see it's 107. So keep in mind that the uh, calculation of the one rep max is going to be more accurate if you are, uh, you know, type of test where the repetition is closer to a uh, one, right? Because if you're uh, trying to calculate your one rep max and you do uh, 100 repetitions with a very very light weight, I mean, it's, it's just super based on how much your endurance is. Whereas if you're trying to calculate your one rep max and you put uh, two reps or three reps instead. Uh, it's very close to what you're trying to calculate, so it's going to be able to do a much better job uh, you know, calculating your one rep max. So yeah, that's all. Uh, the link to the uh, calculator is uh, in the description below. So uh, yeah, enjoy, and if you're a big fan of weighted calisthenics, I think this will be very helpful uh, for your training.